Can you believe it's back to school time already? And one of the most important items on your to-do list should be having your child's eyesight check. This weekend, you can have their vision screen for free. Susie and Steve Kinski joins us now with more. Good to see you both. Thanks for being here. Good, Good morning. You. So you. Susie, who are the Lions? What do you do? Uh, we are women and men who volunteer our time to make the difference in our community through community service, exactly. We, we meet the needs of our community and uh, why not helping children and adults to have their vision screening. And pay it forward, absolutely. What is um, Lions Club International? We are a service organization, one of the biggest service organization in the world. We are 1.4 million members. Wow. We are in 200 countries and plus with 46 million, uh, 6, members and we are celebrating our 100 years anniversary Congrats. of community service. That's wonderful, that's a lot of power and a lot of people doing good work, that's wonderful. Now you're getting ready to hold free vision screenings for adults and children. Why did you decide to do this? You know, we need to breathe to survive. Mm -hmm. We need to see to thrive, plus other senses as well. And why not doing this because this is a community need in our children. And for example, our, grands, our granddaughter, she was not performing well in the school, so she was sent to special ed. One day she came to us and we have our equipment because we, got, we were ready to do another screening. We test her eyes. She needed glasses. Oh my goodness, so that was her problem all along, but she didn't realize. She probably thought it was normal, right? Oh, and she's young, I mean, yes. who thinks that she needs glasses? Absolutely, well, I'm so happy that you're doing this. If you want more information, you can go to denverlions.org. That's denverlions.org. Now, Steve, how long have you been with the Lions? Uh, 20, 21 years. 21 Wonderful, years, and how many free vision screenings does the Denver Lions Club organize? Well, we had to total them up uh, outside, expecting a, a question about that, and. I th I think this is our fourth here locally, and then we've done five or six really around the world. We've been in countries like Senegal and oh my um, goodness. Nepal Ecuador. and Ecuador, where Susie's from. That's wonderful. And we're looking to go to Mongolia. Yeah. Oh, that's wonderful. Boy, you guys are really making a difference worldwide, yeah. internationally. <laughs> What's involved in a free screening vision, vision screening? Well, I, uh, there, are, there are five different steps, but the most important ones are really the ones that test the screening, you know, the usual eye charts. Um, that um, that you're familiar with, you know, to test your, your distance vision. And then we, we do refractions, volunteers, they don't have to be optometrists to do the refractions. It's a, it's a machine that we're trained on and then, and then seeing the doctors is the next step. And then finally, um, what we do is uh, most of the glasses that we, we handle are, are just used eyeglasses through our Recycle for Sight program statewide. Oh, okay. And then for people whose prescription is a little, a little iffy, we provide them glasses for free. Oh, that's so wonderful. So everything's free. That's wonderful. And who's providing the service, the screen? Is We're 100% volunteers. Okay. We have, uh, of course, uh, members of the Denver Lions Club as well from the Lions Club of Colorado. We have uh, people from Inner City Health Center. Uh, we have uh, uh, members and volunteers from Tre Treasury House of Hope, uh, um, workers of All Copy Products, um, a doctor from Mayfair, oh, right. Vision, and a, also a doctor from Walmart. And all of us were volunteers. A to lot do of this. great group of people. Mm -hmm. Where is the free visions going to be held? It's going to be in 3800 York Street okay. here in Denver. 3800 York Street. York Street yeah. is in the, in, at the place where the Inner City Health Center is located. Okay, and if you want more information, again, go to denverlions.org. That's denverlions.org. And do you have to have certain qualifications, Steve, or can anyone get a free vision? No, screen? there's no means testing or, or anything for this. Um, it's just uh, it is a matter of waiting in line because we expect to have um, you know more than a hundred people come. So. Okay, and you mentioned earlier that you do give away free eyeglasses. If we want to donate glasses, oh, can absolutely. we do that? Absolutely, yeah. Most of the uh, optometry shops and then the libraries are the two the two best places to leave glasses at. Pretty much all of them have a box of ours. And where will they go? They'll go to people that need them. Yeah. What 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 happens is that they're sent currently up to. Um, the Sterling Lions Club in Sterling, Colorado, the northeast mm -hmm. corner, and then they work with the prisoners to get it done. Oh, the prisoners okay. actually have equipment that reads the prescriptions, and then the Lions you know, clean it and sort it and, uh -huh. and then ship it. 
Wow, what a great group of people and volunteers that you're associated with. Thank you so much for coming on. Yeah, this Thank is an welcome. important you're service. For inviting us. Be sure to have your child's eyes checked before they go back to class. Volunteers will be offering free vision tests for children and adults this Saturday, August 5th, from 9 a.m. until 3 p.m. at the Inner City Health Center off York Street in Denver. Volunteers may be able to provide you with recycled eyeglasses as well. So visit this website. Go to denverlions.org. That's denverlions.org for more information.